Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today's class, let's discuss about types of patent applications. There are many types of patent applications. We have studied uh, that provisional application or complete application or you can call it as an ordinary application. Then PCT application, PCT application for the international application. Okay, so that we already studied. So provisional is nothing but what our patent application, uh, whatever you are filing without fully explaining or a description about your work. Okay. So it's just one year time will be there within one year you have to go for the uh, complete application. So let's discuss provisional application, a patent application filed when the invention is not fully finalized because you are afraid if somebody comes with the, that invention, so they might get patent. So but you don't have sufficient data to uh, explain the entire concept. So what you can go for it, you can go for the provisional uh, pay, uh, application okay but make sure that within one year you have to give the complete details okay so it is filed whenever the invention is not fully finalized and some part of the invention is still under the experimentation so such type of application helps to obtain the priority date for the invention okay so make sure that within one year you have to file or else provisional application will be rejected automatically next ordinary application a patent application which is filed with complete specification other word for ordinary application is a complete application okay it will should have every specification about your invention okay and also claims should be there that means you what are you what uh, what are the different claims you are doing under that particular uh, this thing application next we are having PCT application it's an international application filed in accordance with the PCT that is patent patent cooperation treaty where all uh, 190 countries are member of it so you can if you write if you go for if you want to go for international patent then you can go for pct so that all the countries of 190 countries you can have that your patent x license you can give so a single application can be filed to seek patent protection okay a single any single application can be filed to seek patent protection in for 190 countries and claim priority in all the members countries of the pct so these are the three different forms first form is provisional form it is only as a big for beginners you don't have sufficient data but you want you don't want someone else to get your the date priority date is very important because after that date if anybody is publishing anybody is doing then it means that they infringed your work understanding that's why provisional application is always important okay next ordinary application is a complete information which includes all the claims specifications description everything that's pct for international standards okay next class we will discuss about with a different topic in the next class